Um, wow. Um, the best advice I think I was ever given actually was by Warren Beatty, who happened, I, I was shooting an episode of the Larry Sanders show, and he, they're good friends and he happened to be there, and he said, it was sort of the beginning of my ER days, and he said, don't do too many publicity things. It makes people know you too well. Mm. Mm. And here we all are. And here we are. <laughs> <laughs> no, but he, you know, because on television you play a character every week you're in someone's house. And if you start then doing a lot of press in other and showing who you are, it gets very convoluted and the acting versus the personal life gets too close together. When you do movies, it's different because you're not in everyone's house mm. once a week. Sure. And on television were these little people that people think they know and can hold. And and on movies you're untouchable, you know, because they're it's larger than life. So I think it was really good advice because it you know, it helped me sort of navigate how I wanted do I want to be an actor or do I want to be famous? How about you, Regina? Oh my gosh. Oh, best advice. That's a hard one, because I mean I've I've been getting advice always <laughs> along the way. <laughs> I guess Marla Gibbs, when I was uh, um, starting on 227, um, just telling me that even if I'm off camera, my job is just as important as when I'm on. Because the more I give that person, the better both of our performance would be. So we all do it together. I mean, it's not just one of us. How about you, Katie? Uh, I was just kind of reflecting on um, uh, the first uh, job I had on a, on a television series was a sitcom with Mary Tyler Moore. And uh, up until that point, I'd just been a singer. My, my goal in life was I was a musician. And somehow I, I, I ended up on a sitcom. I, I, I still, to this day, was not quite sure. Now I feel like, I, yes, I kind of know what I'm doing. But at the time she said to me, I was so overwhelmed by the process, and she said to me, it's one page at a time, one page at a time. One, one beat at a time, and she did this to me, because this is how I was to the camera. I was doing like this. <laughs> <laughs> she would come over to me, and she'd go like this, be in the light. Yeah. <laughs> and it, to me, I mean, it was such, because I sort of learned on the job. I didn't go to school to be an actor, and I learned, as I, I learned on the job. And um, so everything people have said to me has been sort of some form of advice. If I think about it, some of my best advice that I got was from my high school acting teacher. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Mr. Ackley, I have to give him a shout out. Mm -hmm. And he said, it, he told, we were not allowed to be late for rehearsal. If we were late three times, we were out of the play. And take care of your own props. Two of the best pieces mm -hmm. of advice I've ever gotten. Yeah. <laughs> and it stayed, I mean, seriously, it stayed with me. And, and I mean, I'll be really late for social events, but I will almost never be late for work. And it's, mm -hmm. I mean, it's that, you know, he kind of put the fear of God in me about that. But anyway, I think it's a good one. Props are a mystery props. to me I need yeah. to go by skill for props. Well, you have a lot of props. You have lots of props. Too. <laughs> oh. And props where it's like, don't lose that. There's only one of them. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> lose ours is a pen. No pressure. <laughs>